And so people ask me all the time, how did you get so good at your art? And they don't really like the answer, but it's, it's really simple. It's just, it's just practice. And that's a basic principle that we learn in life. We gotta practice the piano, we gotta practice soccer, we gotta practice keeping the commandments, we gotta practice making enchiladas, I don't know what you're doing. But um, I made this painting at the beginning of my mission. I'm gonna share it with y'all. And the Star of David was really, really special to me at the time. It, it, the Star of David literally li represents a covenant with the Lord. And as we promise things to keep his commandments, he's gonna bless us. And that's been the same with my art. As long as I'm practicing, God's gonna bless me with the skills that I don't have. And I got a really specific revelation at the beginning of my mission when I was in my little training. Um, that as long as I give my skills to people and use it to serve others, then God will give me more and he'll make my skills even greater than I could imagine if I give it to other people. But if I was selfish with my art and just kept it for myself, he was going to make my skills stagnant. So that's something that has really motivated me to serve other people and to help them. And that's given me so much joy in my life. I've decided that the thing that gives me the most joy is serving God, making other people happy. And I also did this painting. Um, it just kind of represents the joy that I feel. So this is me sharing the gospel. I got my little trumpet and I'm sharing to the whole world. I don't know if you can tell, but this is the whole world, the gospel. I'm telling them how much I love it, how much I love my Savior Jesus Christ. I feel like art isn't the only thing that's brought me closer to God, but it definitely has been a learning tool for me and has taught me so much about God, about the world, and about myself.